So that's it, we've arrived, we are on the boat. It's a bit of a mess at the moment. Jackie's on the phone waffling to Lisa. Say hello, Jackie and Lisa. Hello. You're gonna be on YouTube later. <laughs> yeah, later. Jackie's been everywhere at the moment, spraying, killing flies off. Spiders? Oh, so not, oh, spiders, yeah. Evil, I, evil spiders. I think it's really cruel, but there we go. No, you are just as bad. There's one there, look. Tiny little spiders, she's killing one. <laughs> anyway, this is us, we're on the boat, so we'll catch up with you later. It's been a long day today. We've um, come up from the caravan um, down at Jackie's mum's house up to Reading. We met the boat. Um, Tony, the guy who moved the boat for us, has just been phenomenal. Helped us out along the way massively. Um, we got no experience of uh, canal boats or anything like that. And uh, he spent the day with us, teaching us the ropes, I guess. Uh, I'm not quite sure we got it yet, but we're on our own. So. Well, not, well, I'm on my own. Jackie is currently winging it. Well, she's got a taxi from where we are, just outside of Reading. Um, I actually don't know where we are. We're moored up uh, in the middle of nowhere. Um, Jackie's managed to get a cab. She's gone back to Reading with Tony and taking Tony back down to Chertsey. And then uh, heading away back to the boat tonight for our first night on the boat alone. Um, and then we head off again tomorrow, trying to try and get towards Bath. I don't think we're going to get there. Um, time constraints, um, closures, all these kinds of things. It doesn't matter. We'll, you know, we'll get as close back in that direction for Christmas as we can. So we'll be with near family. Yeah. So that's where we are. Stayed here last night. Um, it's a beautiful place, lovely spot. And we decided to get a takeaway dinner from this pub. It's called The Cunning Man. It's a great pub. Um, we got some schnitzels and sat on the boat last night and ate our dinner. It was absolutely delicious. Jackie's just gone off to IKEA to try and get some bits and bobs and some other bits from B and Q. And I'm on my own on the boat again, um, trying to get us all set up. Not entirely sure if we're going to move today. We need to get water and we need to get some diesel. I need to empty the loo. We might go tomorrow. We might be alright till tomorrow. Um, which just give us a chance to familiarise ourselves with the boat. Catch you later. Right, so yeah, in the last um, segment you've just seen, um, we've got some lovely food from the pub. Um, but not much has changed since then. We are still in the same spot. We're about four and a half miles outside of Reading. Um, we've had a few issues, um, to say the least. <laughs> um, we've got um, various things going on at the moment. So when the boat, but when the boat, when the boat was brought up from Chertsey, um, we had a diesel leak on board with our stove. So we can't cook. We've got no heating. Um, but we managed to get a biofuel fire, um, which we had in our old house, which is heating um, the boat quite nicely. And also um, the lady we bought the boat from has kindly um, lent us her gas, what do you call it? Um, stove. stove. And that's doing a great job. Um, so that's that. 
Um, and then we woke up this morning and we went to start the engine to get hot water and electricity generated for the rest of the boat and the batteries and found it wouldn't start. So our, our battery had died. Um, so luckily there's a guy just down, more just down from us. And we borrowed some jump leads and uh, he got us going this morning. Um, we ran the engine for about five, six hours, um, charged up all our leisure batteries for um, hot water, um, electricity, to keep us going for the day. And then I switched it off and um, it wouldn't restart. So we think the alternator is possibly packed up. So my mate John, down in Burnham sea is gonna have a video call me tomorrow and hopefully we'll get that resolved and get that back up and running. Um, we haven't moved simply because um, the Kennet River where we are is in flood, it's on red alert, um, it's flowing quite quickly. Um, so we can't move forward. Uh, we also have a closure at Woolhampton at the moment, which is about five, six miles in that direction. Not that really you know what that direction is, but it's that way towards Bath. Um, so it's looking very unlikely when we get home for Christmas, um, but that's fine. So we will be on the boat and probably having a stir fried turkey on Christmas day. <laughs> we've got a, a single ring um, uh, hob, which we're gonna do our cooking on and go from there. Yeah. Jax has um, been out shopping all day, having yeah. fun, buying lots of little bits for the boat, um, and also spent the evening sewing up some curtains. And well, basically, you bought some curtains, didn't you? And chopped them up. Chopped them up, and <laughs> she's making them small enough to fit the. I keep calling it the caravan because we've lived in the caravan for a week or two. Yeah, a week, and uh, it feels like we're in the caravan, still, but a bigger caravan. Um, so, yeah, Jackie's doing the curtains. And making it homely and we're going to try and tomorrow go out and get a sofa from Ikea yes yeah and somehow squeeze it through our doors which are tiny it will um, fit it yeah well hopefully it'll fit through I hope so uh, we'll see so hopefully we'll have a sofa to sit on tomorrow night um, we'll make it fit yeah <laughs> what else are we up to oh we've got to go and get a multimeter tomorrow um, yeah you've got to fix it yeah I've got to try and fix the alternator um, I'm going to do a video call with John down at Burnham He's going to help me and talk me through that and hopefully we'll get that sorted out. And then we might be able to move on um, a few miles, hopefully, and yeah. get close to home. So yeah, that's it really. That's all this video is about. Just a quick update where we are, um, what we're doing, and yeah, thanks for watching us. <laughs> <laughs> See you later. Take care. All. Oh, yeah, before we go, massive thank you to um, Lisa, Lisa, and Nick. And Pat. And Pat, who are looking after the shop for us whilst we um, make our way back towards home. Um, we are really grateful to you guys. Um, so you all take care and we'll see you soon.